From the Tennessee Valley Weather Center, this is your afternoon weather update. Good Thursday afternoon. I'm Kelly Rawson here in the Weather Center with a check at your forecast. We are talking heat today as well as the potential for a few strong storms later on this afternoon. All those details here in this weather update. You can see this storm complex over into Missouri and Illinois. That is what we are going to be keeping an eye on as we progress throughout the next several hours. We will unfortunately be dealing with a few more storms just like the last few days. So let's go ahead and talk about the heat first. We do have a heat advisory in effect for all of our northwest West Alabama counties as well as Tishomingo County, Mississippi and Hardin County, Tennessee. This is for uh, heat index values up to 109 degrees this afternoon before the potential storms arrive. So be sure to be taking frequent breaks over the next few hours. If you have to be outside, it is going to be very warm with air temperatures in the mid 90s and then those heat index values close to 110. Now, as far as the storm threat goes, we are most of us in a level two out of five risk for severe weather in this yellow color and then in this green color level one out of five risk for severe storms for later on today and tonight the main threats like the last few days are going to be damaging winds as well as some hail i think the damaging wind threat is a little bit higher just like the last few days but can't rule out any hail either as we head throughout the rest of today. So let's go ahead and break down what we can expect on a future cast. About 2 p.m., you see a few storms off near Interstate 65. However, I do think they could extend a little bit more westward this afternoon, and they will continue to progress southeastward as they do so. And then we could see some redevelopment later on this afternoon and evening, but that is going to depend on how far west that initial line of storms does extend. So we will keep an eye on that if it works over the atmosphere or if we do expect several rounds of storms. We will keep you guys updated as we head throughout the rest of today. And again, temperature is going to be very warm for today. And then for your Friday morning, we could still see a few rounds of storms overnight and even to start off your Friday morning with the temperatures in the 70s. And then we are expecting a few rounds of storms for Friday as well as this cold front. The good news is, is that cold front that has been uh, firing off some storms off toward northwest, bringing them to our area. It's going to be finally approaching us, unfortunately going to mean a little bit of a stormy Friday. But after we get through Friday, you are going to love, and I mean love, the weekend forecast. So another stormy day for tomorrow in addition to today. But check out these rain chances as we head into Saturday. Just a stray rain chance for the morning. But overall, we are going to be dry and comfortable for both Saturday and Sunday. And very minimal rain chances as we head throughout the beginning of the next week unfortunately that does mean heat builds back up but until then the weekend is looking nice with low humidity so your hometown forecast for this afternoon again storms possible this afternoon evening and overnight a few rounds chances are a little bit spotty doesn't look too too widespread but we are seeing the signs for a few rounds of storms just depending on how that initial line of storms decides to play out so check uh, be sure to uh, be ready for a few thunderstorms this afternoon with temperatures in the mid to upper 90s for actual air temperatures. Same story for northwest Alabama and northeast Mississippi. We're looking very warm today with the air temperatures. And like I mentioned, heat index values between 105 and 109 degrees. Here is your seven day forecast from the Tennessee Valley Weather Center. After we get through Friday, a stormy afternoon, evening and overnight is in store. But then by the time we get to the weekend, check out these temperatures mid 80s and the humidity is also going to be quite low. So it's going to be very comfortable Saturday and Sunday as well. But then the heat starts to build back up heading into Monday. We make it back to the lower 90s by Tuesday with maybe a stray rain chance. But overall, we're looking pretty dry for now heading into next week. Of course, there is still plenty of time for that forecast to change.